Good morning. It is Friday. I think it's the tenth of September. It is a miserable Friday. It is raining from the heavens. Just left the house. I'm going up to B and Q. I need to get fuel as well. It is. I'm running a bit late. It's been five to eight, but B and Q don't open till eight o'clock, so I'm not too bad. Uh, just left the house two minutes ago and uh, make our way up there and get a tin off uh, paint for the woodwork because stuff she got yesterday, that home base satin, is rubbish. It is really crap. Sorry home base but you didn't make really good paint and I, I know it's probably affordable but for the job it's intended for you need about two or three coats and each one takes about one to two hours to dry and I really don't have that kind of time. I want to get it smashed up today, I want to get the, the doors and the woodwork done. That bedroom will more or less be finished today. Then I'm into the hall, and make a start with that. Then hopefully tomorrow, or Monday, even Monday, it doesn't really matter, I get back out and do the laminate flooring. Now the laminate shouldn't take that long, it should only take, what, half a day I think. But I'm stuck on Blacklaw Road here, in Dunfermline, and there's traffic lights set up here. Obviously digging up somewhere. And they've got a three-way system set up here. I've not heard it been sat here for about two, three minutes, so come on. Let's make a move. Come on, lights, let's do it. I just realised that with 12 minutes worth of footage, uh, recording time left, I'll have to delete some things off my phone. And I've turned the phone around to landscape mode. Don't say the lights have turned green for, for these ones. Uh, I've turned it around so we can get the <laughs> widescreen as I've just uploaded other videos and I've been recording a whole lot on portrait mode so that didn't really work it too well. But I'm still learning with the videos, you know, I've done a few already and I'm still learning with it yet. And I need to learn to look at the camera instead of looking at myself on the, car, the phone itself. Now this kind of the back of me, he's wanting to fucking go past. You ain't getting a chance pal. Oh, what? These lights are frozen. These lights are definitely fucking frozen. No way, man. Oh, what? Tell you what, as soon as this traffic's fucking passed... Fuck it. Gonna go for it. Gonna go for it. Come on. Oh, fuck that. We're not changing it though. I'm sitting here all fucking day. <clears throat> I was just stuck at red and none of them are changing, so the other guys come out and sort them. We'll just skip past them. Who cares? Oh, we've got flooding as well. Nice one. We're in the vicinity of Dunfermline, I suppose they'd have been in Scotland, I think Perth's had it really bad, up the Broxton Roundabout, it's all here up there, it's like a swimming pool. Uh, I think the summer's definitely over, we're into autumn now, and uh, yeah, I think the weather kind of reflects that because it's wet. <laughs> so it's the kind of jobs you want to be doing indoors anyway, so I don't mind that. So this, this bedroom uh, and hall is perfect for me, so keep dry, keep warm, and let the good times roll. So, gonna go up to BQ, get my money to get, and I'll catch you in a bit. And I need to go and get fuel and tobacco as well. So, I'll catch you in a bit. And in fact, I'll catch you down at the job. So, hope everyone's fine, guys. Mind, uh, do me a favor, subscribe, hit that like button, and give me some support and help the channel because that's me going to start uploading a lot of more videos now. And I'm going to try and do it more frequently. And I'm just going to do it with the phone. I've got the wee camera there, but it's a lot of hassle plugging it in and downloading it on all the rest of it. Rubbish, so with the phone it's instant, I can just upload it right away, so it's probably the best way to go. The quality seems pretty decent as well, so why not? Okay, so top of the morning guys, and I'll catch up with you later on. Be good. Keep it real. <laughs> top of the morning. Here we are, we've been to b &Q. we're just about to go into the job and we just had to make an emergency stop because the car was needing fed and I'm needing fed as well. 
So we've got to fuel the belly, then get down to the job and get in there because it is absolutely a honk of a rest of the weather we've got today. It is absolutely teaming it down. Sorry for all you guys that's working outdoors and then diggers and all that and trucks and all the rest of it. Been there, done that. Uh, I think I'll have a day indoors. So we'll catch you at the job guys. Catch you in a bit. I'm gonna feed my belly. Bye. Right, this is gonna be a mismatch eh? orientation for you guys. <laughs> Either portrait or landscape. Camera's over there. Camera's there. I need to start looking over there. I need to circle that. I need to highlight it so I can see it. But anyway, how are we doing everybody? Everybody okay? Good. It is Friday, we made it, yes! And I've just filled my belly with a nice uh, milk latte out of Greg's, as you've as you seen, pardon me. <laughs> and uh, such an omelette baguette and a yum yum. In fact, okay, two. So I had to get a bit of breakfast, I was starving. But I'm ready to rock and roll, it's just gone nine o'clock. I've got the, to do the painting. This is actually really good. One coat is all you need. And it's quick dry as well. So, we'll get that slapped on, the woodwork and the doors, and we'll see how it takes, and we'll take it from there. So, catch you in a bit, guys. Let's go up and do it. Yep. Good morning. Customers then. So I'm gonna try and be discreet as I can. Um, not today's task is to be doing all the glossing. There we go. All this. And I've got better paint for it as well. The stuff I was using yesterday was crap. I've got that stuff. Too much sandwood. Quite dry. Brilliant. There's two coats I've had already. I've just got the doors to do, but I've got the roller for them. I've got them in. So I've got that done in a wee bit. But what I have got. I went and got frog tape yesterday. I've taped it along here, as you can see, it's all the green. Now, I had to do, is a pin on something you need to take it off and realign it, so I've done it, I was taking a wee bit of the back off. I've got a funny feeling this is going to do a wee bit of damage when I peel it off, but I can touch it up, that's easy. So, I got to there with the green, and I thought I'll just try the ordinary masking tape around the doors, because I've done that here. For this red. And you can't just see on the camera, I need to roll this again. You see where I've cut in? And this is a two coats. It's difficult to need a third. But I'll get that later. I can get it tonight, that's no problem. So I'm interested to see what the green's like when I peel it off. Which is frog tape and it cost me 8 49 out of screw fix. For that. And this is packet three. That's the second one nearly gone, but you get a pack of three for about, about eight quid or something, maybe being cute. So it'll be interesting to see what it's like. So I think this needs one more coat. I'll let it do its business. Let it dry. I'll concentrate on the doors next. Get them rolled. Get them done. And I can peel it off and see the, see the mess that it makes. <laughs> I've got a funny feeling I'll peel some of that right off as well. <coughs> It's the day after Queen Elizabeth II passed away, and I think the country's in mourning. Now, I'm not into the monarch or anything like that, but she was a mother, she was a, a granny, and she was respected by a lot of people, so, you know, she's a human being, she passed away. So, it's just the way it is, it's life, I guess. So I've been just to see Charles, now he's king. What glory, what glory stuff is he going to bring to the country? Hopefully better than what's happening in the now anyway. So anyway, it's Friday, like I said, it's, I think it's about back at 11. So I'm going to nip out, grab a quick drink, a quick cigarette, come back in and go for the doors. So, catch you in a bit. Happy Friday, guys. Stay safe. Hey, we've just come back in from a cigarette. We're going to peel this off and see what it's like. The front needs a, a third coat, but on the edge it seems to be fine. That's good enough to see the darkness, so we're going to do it together. Have we ready? Now remember, this is the blue tape. This is the cheap stuff at your B&Q. So far, so good. Nice. Let's stick that there in it. OK, 
Okay, here we go. Like I said, that's a that's the cheap stuff. Now we'll go for the dear stuff. Are we ready? <laughs> I'm a bit nervous. Here we go. Let's see what damage this does. It's a lot more tacky. Not bad. Not bad. Oh well. Fair bit of chew. Not bad at all. Look at this there. Okay. It's not the greatest, but it's good enough. Oh, the top of the scut looks seems to have done fine. Hmm. I'm interested to see this one. There we go. Uh, let's peel a bit of the paint off. It seems to have only peeled off bits that I've repaired. And time you touch it up, you'll never see it. Ah, it's okay. Mm -hmm. It's one of those things. Just in the top there, the paint off. Now that's the way it was damp, so I understand that's why it's taken it off. That was a big bit of repair. Five minutes away, that's all that solid. Sounds fine. So, yeah, looking good. Peel the rest of this off and I'll show you guys later on. Okay, see you in a bit. Spot on, right, she is away. She's just went away to do whatever, shopping or whatever she's doing. So I've got the place back to myself, so here we go. Once again, it's, uh, I'm going to get the doors coated now, the cardboard, protect the floor, get this all coated up, get the handles off. Uh, they've done me an Allen key, so that's easy, I've got the Allen keys there. And we'll get them rolled, looking a bit whiter. You can see the difference, see, look at that. Now, that home based rubbish that I used yesterday, that stuff there. Where was it? This stuff here. Like that. It's not the good, you know. They say it's quick dry, and all the rest is bloody, bloody, blah. blah, blah. But it's not, I, I wouldn't even say it's white. This lid here is the stuff I bought the day, it's Dulux uh, Quick Dry Satin, okay? Let's do a comparison. I've not done this yet, so you're going to do... see this with me. Now... Oh, great. So it's water-based, it'll wipe off. Okay, water here. There you go, see? Like that. Right, look at that, look at the comparison. The tin of paint's over there, that's the lid of it. Now look how thick that is, look how it's staying on the lid. Now I gave that a shake this morning, so that is, see, wet. But look at that, that's stuff from home base. I don't know how much that is, but even look at the colour. That was more yellow than that one, look. So what chance have you got? I don't know how much they charge for it, but I'd imagine that there was 28 quid. 28 quid on the shelf, I've got the trade card, I turned it to the counter, put it through, it came through at 22 quid. I said to the woman, wow, for 10%, that's a hefty, hefty discount. She goes, it's actually 20%. So 20%? It's like, yeah, only till Monday. Like, right. And this is the 9th of September, not the 10th, I said the 10th this morning. 10th of September. I'm stuck in uh, the traffic jam. But uh, yeah, so you can see how I wasn't really getting anywhere yesterday with that paint. So it's up to you if you want to go and get that, but for a wee bit, uh, that's probably, I would say that's probably under 20 quid. That, you're paying for a brand name. You get, you get what you pay for. It's far, far better. So the edges are done. Just this, this one to do, but we'll get the handle off now and we'll get a start. So I'm going to put some tunes on and pure radio I listen to. Uh, 
and it's a wee bit different today. They're playing Kenny laid back music because obviously they got the Queen passing away yesterday. So it's a wee bit of respect. But it's actually good to hear different tunes and I'm singing my heart out, so good job you're not actually hearing me or you'll be turning off. And you'll be giving me a thumbs down. <laughs> you probably give me a thumbs down anyway, but come on. You know this is uh this is my channel as you know, I've got a few videos out already and I want to keep it going. And it would really, really help the channel if you just go to my go to the video and just click the like. For every single video I've got, just please click the like. Even give me a comment, good or bad. You don't even have to click the thumbs up button, you can click the thumbs down button. It's so one, it doesn't really matter. I don't have any thumbs down buttons yet pressed. But there's always time, there's always time. So, let's get to it. Enough chatting, let's get working. Gonna think the time now is bang on half eleven. So, let's get to it. Happy Friday everybody, let's do it! <laughs> you alright? I've just come back from lunch, uh, the flat I'm working is just not that far away from here. I just thought I'd come down to the shorefront and just let you see what I'm actually looking at. I mean it's, it's gorgeous, I grew up down here, well, this neighbourhood anyway, in Burkeden which is just to the right of me. Uh, so I'm kind of used to this view but every now and again you come down here and you still got a wee surprise and it's, it's lovely. Even the smell of the sea air. You ready? Here we go. There's a cruise liner in, in the docks over the road there. Beautiful. I don't know where he goes to. I don't know. He's from here or what? The bridges. Stunning shot. Queen's Ferry Crossing. You can see three bridges from here. Right, enough having uh, too much luxury at this job. <laughs> you get in and get some work done. Uh, so I'm into the hall now and uh, we'll go up and make sure all the brushes are ready and we can start. Now that's 25 past two, I'm hoping to finish about five, six o'clock, so I'd like to hear the ceilings emulsioned in the hall and maybe even a start with the paintwork in the hall, if I can get all the edging done, that'd be good. Then tomorrow I can come out and roll it. That just leaves Monday for the laminate flooring, so we're doing bloody good. I'm pretty chuffed with the way things are going, so. We'll see you inside, guys, and hope everyone's having a nice day. As I said earlier on, it's the day after the Queen's unfortunate death. Uh, she died peacefully, I think, at Balmoral. And uh, obviously the country is in mourning. It's just one of those things, what do you do? So I'm just about to run out of time here on my recording because I've taken up all the space on my phone, so I'm going to have to delete some stuff. But I'll get some photos and maybe a wee update later on, guys. So hope everyone's fine and let's do this. Keep it real. Keep it real. <laughs> Right, all the paintwork's been done. There's been three coats on it with the Dulux. Brilliant stuff. Covers well. No hassle. Touched up all the wee imperfections above the skirting. That's all been done. Uh, now I can move on to the hall and get that done. So there we are. And even the doors have been coated. What do you think? Not bad, eh? Not bad for a Friday. Keep it real. That's what I want anyway. Okay, I have six minutes worth, oh, six minutes, I think I've got as much as that. I have six minutes worth of recording time left. Something's been deleted from my phone because I had less than that. I'm sure I had about two minutes, unless I'm recording it on a lesser format, but never mind. I uh, didn't manage to video anything much, apart from what you see, and that's the bedroom done. So we're done there, we're into the hall, and we've first coated everything, the ceiling's been two coated, all the cutting in the other side's been done. Oh, the door surrounds have all been done. Skirts have been done twice. So it just leaves doors and the walls. Shouldn't take long tomorrow. I'll tell her I'll be round at nine tomorrow. So not too much an early start. I get a lion. She'll probably get a lion. Um, yeah, so all good. Then that leaves Monday for the laminate flooring. So we'll get the decorating out of the road tomorrow. Then laminate floor Monday. Then that's just finito. We are done. 
So another job wrapped up and good to go. So I'm gonna get up the road now, grab a bite tea, I need to go to the co-op. Grab some juice and uh, something to eat for my tea because I'm not having any takeaways tonight. I'm just gonna have some simple simples. So that's it, that's a wrap for Friday. It's quarter past six at night, and I'm gonna get my ass up the road now and call it a day. But thanks very much for watching again. It's just a simple wee video, just another progress and video of what you see, part three. I think I'll do daily vlogs like this when I get big jobs and just keep it going. So if you like this sort of content, please give me a thumbs up. No one seems to be giving me a thumbs up, so it's telling me that you're not interested. So do I keep it going, do I not? Is it worth my while? Am I just wasting my time? Whatever. But I'm enjoying doing it, so as long as you enjoy watching it, then I'm all happy. And there's someone just walking past, so no doubt she'll see me and wave. She's gonna look. No, she's just not bothered her backside. So I'm just going to have a swig of vodka before I have a, a drive up the road. <laughs> ah, that's the spot. As if it was vodka. Anyway, right. So, up the road now. Friday is a wrap. This week is a wrap just about. Back from tomorrow. So, we'll catch you later on, guys. Thumbs up, subscribe, and any comments down below. And... I'll give you another video hopefully tomorrow for the conclusion. Or maybe I'll wait until Monday for the next one. Mm -hmm. No, you'll see the decorating tomorrow, so I might just fling up a few photos tomorrow on Facebook. I might not release a video, but Monday you'll see the lamp phone getting done. And I've done a few of them in the last couple of months, so that's a very good one. So enjoy guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll catch up with you later. Keep it real! Good morning everybody, it is Saturday the 10th of September, it's just got 9 o'clock, we've just arrived at the job, going to go in now and make a start with the decorating in the hall, the bedroom's more or less finished, just got the radiator to do but I've got a radiator in the hall as well so I can get the two at once, I'll get the masked up and get them sprayed, because there's only got one tin of spray so hopefully that'll be enough to do the two of them, but that, I can do that Monday, but I'm trying like to get the bedroom done today because we're doing laminate floor on the Monday so I want all the painting done today so it's five past nine i'm running five minutes late because nature called and you've got to do what you got to do just gonna have another swig of my vodka to get the day started oh, you going. hope everyone's doing good uh, please click the like button up or down preferably up subscribe the little notification bell bing that'll be there bing and if you do that, you'll get updated every time I upload a new video, which is going to be happening quite frequently. So I hope everyone's fine. It's a lovely day by the looks of it. I think the rain has been and gone. And uh, let's get to it. Keep it real, guys. Keep it real. I hope everyone's having a nice day. Let's do it. A few moments later. Yo. How are we doing? Well, I think the time is currently 20 past 11. Not bad. We've been here two hours, 20 minutes so far. And we're getting there. Doing the cutting in the hall, we've done the ceiling yesterday, that's all done. Uh, it's the walls today. I've cut them twice. A little problem. Well, not a problem, but a little weird thing. The paint she's got is like a perfect kind of similar match to what she's already on the wall, so when you're cutting in, you don't really see it. I've started in here cutting in this morning, right? That's white from the roof. Now, obviously, I've cut along the edges. All the edges have been cut once. I've got a second cutting to do. There's a slight difference. It's called Silver Cloud. Once again, home base. Yeah, say any matter about that. But I've not long done that, so it's still drying, so you can see it a wee bit better there. So, obviously, I've started in there, then I've worked on. So what about what wrong this way? Don't know that bright's hair or done. We need a second coat, you can still see the white through it. So definitely a second coat. We think we bit to sand. We bit there, we bit there, a couple of holes. And I missed a hole in there, so I'll have to fill that one in. And I think she's only been in this place three months. You would think you would, when you go to buy a place, you would have had an EICR. Electrical installation. Certification report, and it basically a company will come in, do tests on other circuits, 
maybe take face plate sav and have a quick look at the wire behind it and see what it's like. This place was built a, a roughly 1996, okay? Now obviously it was old colours and all the rest of it and there's been things added over the years and modified and whatever. It's like the BT, there's been phone lines run, run with the skirting boards, that was the kitchen somewhere. There was one over there, on the skirting board over there. That's been taken off and disconnected. It's like when you're taking face plates off, right? Light switches so you can paint behind them. I wonder why the bathroom light wasn't working. Now I just pulled it out. Do you see it? One live wire. Just pulled right out. In fact, there's two there. I've just noticed there's two. Can you see it? Those two there. I'm going to touch them because they're switched on. Those two go into this screw terminal here. Now, I've not even checked it, but I bet that wasn't even tight. And to top it off, so what do you think is missing from this box then? Do you see it? Now we see the wires. See the two wires that's pulled at the back there? What else is missing? Now, it's a plastic back box. Yeah. Metal front plate. So what is missing? I wonder if I should tell you or you leave your comments down below. But I'm going to tell you. And see this brass terminal here? Oh, right there, I'm focusing right on, right now. Right there. There's meant to be a flying lead. Or there's meant to be your earth coming into that. Now, let's have a look at the earth. They come into a, a connector block. Okay? So why did they put them in a connector block and then just take them out there and sh or put a fly lead in this faceplate? Because what will happen is, just imagine the two wires were to work their way loose, okay? And just by the magic of power, whatever you want to call it, they came in contact with this. Now the owner comes up, turns the light switch on, zap. She's fried. So that's why I think there should be an EICR and it would pop it before the sale and it's bought. This isn't a private landlord, this is a private house. She's bought it. <laughs> she bought a room with a view. I think you've seen the view already. But there are just a wee flaws that I'm picking up on. And I'm going to finish the cutting in here. She's just went to the shop here so I can't see her being long. So I just thought I'd take this time, just a wee update. Let's be a bit to do, then I'll have to go around it a second time and second coat it. Then it'll be a roll in it. Then I can do the doors. I've taken all the hardware off the doors. With the face plates and everything, so I can just paint right around that. So I'll be easier for myself. Probably have to mask up the glass, I would think. That'll take about five, ten minutes. It's only one side. It's only the hall I'm doing, not the living room, not the kitchen. I'm going to do this and go down for a quick cigarette and come back up then crack on. By that time everything should be dry, so. It's already Saturday and I'm still half sleeping in my head, so that's why the words are now really coming, flowing up my mouth, is So I just thought I'd share that with you, but just shows you here, yeah, you've got to keep an eye on things. So you're taking face weights off and the wires come at the back. Just shows you someone's been paying attention, eh? So we'll look at that and I'll give you a report. By the end of today, I'm going to be working till about 3, 4 o'clock today. It's Saturday, so I don't want to work all day. And it is my birthday on Tuesday, so which is the 13th of September, so I'm only going to be 25. I wish. Turn the numbers around the other way. <laughs> so, crack on guys, and I'll catch you later. Thanks very much. Bye. Right, it's quarter past six on a Saturday night. <laughs> I like to punish myself, but that's all I've done. Everything's double coated. It was looking sweet. All the furniture back in the doors. Uh, light switches put back on the wall. Fly leads put back on the back of the metal boxes, and everything's done. So it's looking good. It's ready to be done, but yeah, that's it. Well, guys, that was a nine hour shift I done today. Uh, started at roughly about 10 past nine, finished at 10 past six. The customer kindly made me a couple of coffees and a roll with meat and cold water and everything on it. I get the best customers, they're amazing. Super. That's why I love doing this show. It's the people that you meet really respect you. It's amazing. It's not always a bit of money. The money helps, it pays the bills, but it's just 
beating you people like that. Sorry. So we're back there on Monday. I uh, hope you have enjoyed what you've seen. Um, Slam your phone on Monday. There's all the decorating is done now. I did get the radio sprayed. I don't know if I've got a photo. If I don't, I'll stick on it. But thanks very much for watching, guys. I totally appreciate it. As you can tell, I'm at home. Enjoying a nice beer. Chilling out. It's been a long day and I'm just chilling here with a nice beer, feet up, watching the TV. Just finishing the last bit of the video so I can get it uploaded so you guys can watch over the weekend. You should be so lucky. <laughs> I'm sorry for you. But thank you very much for watching guys. Again, I keep saying it all the time but please do me a favour, hit that like button. It doesn't cost you nothing. Hit subscribe, hit that e bell. Bing! It doesn't cost a penny, all you do is click it and you'll just get updated every time I upload new videos. As simple as that, that's all you do. And uh, I won't ever ask you for any money or anything like that, so I'm just asking you to support the channel, make it worthwhile for me to post these videos up and if there's any interest, you can do something as well. So I'm going to leave you guys, enjoy your weekend and thank you very much for watching and you take care and it's been a pleasure. Sweet redemption, I will never let